Hello viewers, as I committed, this channel is created for videos of Automation Anywhere cloud-based RPA platform. I upload videos of different commands, actions and other related contents which can help in understanding the platform and development of real-time bots. So today we will learn how to register in Community Edition website of Automation Anywhere and install bot agent. I will also create a bot using message box and we will confirm that we have downloaded our bot agent successfully as well as we will see where our bot locks their message and just for your information community edition is for students new developers proof of concept and evaluation of the product all commands and most features are accessible in community edition few features like unattended bot runner administrator access to create users work load management etc are not available in community version for full features we have to go for enterprise edition so let's start so firstly we will search for automation anywhere community edition and in this case we will get this page for community edition free trial let's click on this it will open a page where we have to provide informations to register so here we have first name last name business email phone number company and other things fine we have to provide all informations we have to enable this checkbox and we will have to click on this get free community edition button and after clicking on our provided business email we will get a message where we get informations for our control room like here we can see control room URL username and password so here is our control room let's open it and using this information username and password we can log in to our control room and when we log in for first time we will get a new page where we have to log we have to create our new password providing the mail one and when we click we will log in to our control room so here we are in control room where we can get different provided already available features which are accessible now here we can see that we have logged in with this our email id we deserve all at gmail.com and here we can see that uh, our device our bot agent is not created and connected so firstly we will have to download our device so let's connect let's click on this connect and then connect to my computer fine and now it has started downloading bot agent so it will take some time let it get download well our bot agent is downloaded and we can see here in our download folder and uh, here you can see that bot agent is downloaded and it's in other other installation steps is not yet started so firstly we will double click on this downloaded exe file excellent we will go for all users will select yes well our bot engine is downloaded successfully 
and uh, as we have as uh, automation anywhere required some chrome extension and it is not downloaded yet so we will click on need help we will click to get our extension we will click on enable this item now our extension is downloaded successfully and it is being deducted internally and here you can see that yes it's done and yes and just for your information here you have to provide your device name for me it is here and also system password not community or control room password but your system password which when you lock you have to provide to open your windows so for me it is yes entered and we have to click on update excellent we can see that now our device icon is green so we are able to install our device successfully now we'll go to our automation tab to create a bot and here already i have a message box bot and also you can create a message box bot by typing here in access actions tab as message and you will get this message box double clicking you can double click or drag this message box and you can type here so for me already i have this box so let's delete it and it's saved now we will run fine we are able to print our message box if we are getting this message box it means our command is working properly and we are able to download and install our bot agent successfully so let's close it and we are good to go here now now we can see whatever our bot engine runs it logs to a file so we'll go and see our bot launcher location or log file location so we'll come to c drive inside c drive we'll go to program data sometimes this program data is hidden so you have to disable it so that you can see so double click on program data now to automation anywhere inside bot runner there is log file and inside logs here we here we have this bot launcher log so here you can see it's updating and whatever error or messages or informations we want we can see here if this video is useful for you please do not miss to hit like button and you can subscribe also to get more videos related to automation anywhere platform thanks for watching